All right, we're on day 134 of my case study, testing out the My Legion secret system. My name is Mike Geyser, and if you're new here, do hit the like button, the subscribe, and bell icon on your way in if what you want to do is follow along with someone's journey, testing out a system, seeing if it's profitable, seeing what results you can get with it. And you know, like a little case study, because that's what I'm doing here. I'm giving you a case study of my day-to-day -day experiences with this system and how it's working and sharing with you my tips and tricks that I find out along the journey. But if you watched yesterday's episode, you probably have seen what the results are already because there's a little bit of a spoiler there. So we're gonna stay, you know, stay tuned to see what happened. Uh, did I get any extra sales or did anything else happen? Stay tuned later on, I'll go over that. But before I do that, let's bring everyone here up to speed as far as what this system is and how it works. So I've been doing this system now for, like I said, 134 days, well into month five now. And so far, I've been profitable. I broke even day 50, day 60 I was in profit. And I used to say that as long as things continue as they are, I'm in profit 400 to 500 bucks a month. But now I'm in profit 800 bucks a month. That's where I'm sitting at right now. $1,000 income each month with this program. I'll go into this a little bit more in depth in a bit as far as why it's uh, 1,000 gross and 800 net profit. But that's where I'm sitting at right now. And this system is designed to give us leads each day, 100 leads each day. And these leads are building up in the back office. And what we're doing with these leads, 3,000 a month, then it becomes 6,000 and 9,000 as the months progress, is we're mailing out to them with the inbuilt mailer over here, this mailing system here, right? We're using this to mail out to them and we're getting products to promote to them from clickbank.com, the affiliate marketplace. We're going over there, finding vendors uh, that have products to promote in the internet marketing space because that's what these people are looking for. They're looking to make money online in some form or fashion. So we're going there, finding money-making products. We're going to the vendor who has these swipe files, 10 of them, to promote their products with. We're copying those 10 swipe files, you know, one by one, pasting them in here, the emails, and sending out emails, promoting this product. Uh, there are actually two products we're promoting from ClickBank. And we are getting sales that way. That's how it's working out. Now, one thing I want to mention to you, first I should mention that this system is a cheaper alternative than doing solo ads. So normally when you do solo ads, you're paying like, uh, what is it, 50 bucks for 100 clicks over and over again, somewhere around there, and you are spending 40 to 50 bucks or 30 to 40 bucks for an autoresponder, right? And that's going to go up as the leads build up. So that gets really expensive. The more leads, the more you're trying to grow your list. If you wanna grow your list at a decent rate, you're gonna to have to spend a lot of money on traffic, a lot of money on clicks. And those clicks don't necessarily convert over into sales and you don't necessarily make your money back. So it's a, it's a endeavor that's costly. So in contrast, here you're spending 30 bucks a month. So you're spending $1 for every 100 leads each day and you're also spending 30 bucks on the first month as an initial setup fee. So first month, you have the initial setup fee of 30 bucks. Then you have the 30 bucks for the recurring billing. That's $60 total. Then second month, it's just the 30 bucks recurring. Okay, so that's how that system, this system operates. And one other key thing to this is that we're not only getting 100 leads a day because if you refer someone using this referral link here, to my legion secret you will get 100 bonus leads so then you'll get 200 leads a day instead of just 100 leads a day which is 6000 leads at the end of the month then 12000 leads month 2 right and it doesn't even stop there because if you have no one to refer you can refer yourself so if you've got this account here and this account here referred underneath this you're getting 200 leads here 100 here that is 300 leads a day which is 9,000 leads at the end of the month, then 18,000 month two. So you can see how this is racking up. Now again, even though 200 leads is the maximum, you can chain accounts, which means you can have one account under here, one account under this, the second account, the third account here, and then a fourth account under the third, and a fifth account under the fourth, you see? 
you can chain your accounts like this and I've got seven accounts each one is underneath the, the prior one so they're getting 200 200 200 except the bottom one that has that has 100 there's nothing underneath it but I was able to get some bonus signups even on my bottom account so that now I've got seven accounts at 200 each that is 1,400 leads a day now that's how I was able to get these crazy results and if you're looking to come on board with this I'd say a recommended is five accounts to go with at least then you're getting a thousand leads a day if you get that bonus sign up on the bottom account I'll go over that later on you'll get 900 leads a day to start with five accounts okay and uh, so that's what I would suggest to you recommend it to see some decent results in a reasonable time frame if however you're strapped for cash go with a minimum of two accounts that way you're at least taking advantage of the bonus leads and over time you can upgrade and get three accounts four accounts and so on but i would suggest five accounts because then you're at least because patience is the main issue with everyone that i've seen come on board with this across the board patience is the biggest challenge that people face they're not willing to give this a fair shake you know month three month four is where things pop off you'll get your first sale week three to week four on average but you need to wait for the leads to build up to that critical mass point where sales start coming in on mass. And um, for me, I started getting back-to-back -back sales beginning of month four, around there. And a lot of other people have seen things start popping off week three, not week three, month three, month three and month four. So what I would suggest to you, go with a number of accounts that you can comfortably hold for three to four months. That way you give yourself the best opportunity for you to see success. It's not a good idea to say, for instance, get, because there are people that get seven accounts, there are people that get 10 accounts, and even more accounts. So what I would say to you is, if you can't hold 10 accounts for more than one month or two months, don't do that. Go with half the number of accounts, like if you're going with 10 accounts, I'm saying, as an example. Go with five ac accounts in that case, and hold those five accounts for four months instead of two months, you know? It's a better strategy to go that route. So, having explained all of this, uh, I think I've covered all my bases here with you. So, let's now go into the results for the day. Did I get a sale? And as you know, if you saw previous, the previous episode, I had a small sale. Let's see what's changed. Nothing's changed. We still got the $12.51 baby sale, and we are still at $134.03 for the week. Now, that's there, there's something I got to share with you and it is huge and it is let me see which tab is it not this one it is we got 1.97 thousand hops this is a record number of hops we almost hit 2,000 hops for the day insane number of hops so we are bound to get a sale today I mean with that number of hops this is the let me just show you the, the prior history over here all these spikes, these green spikes, are, are high, are, are spikes and hops, right? This is 1.77 thousand. This is 1.58 thousand, 1.59, 1.83. This was the previous high over here. Now, we went all the way past 1.83 to 1.97. So we are at a record here. Let me just go back over here to yesterday. We are at 1,966 hops and we got seven order form impressions and that one sale for $12.51. So we are bound to see a sale come in today. So we will see, let's see if this sale that comes in is a, is a haymaker or what do we say here? It's, it's something that's gonna bring the bacon home. It's gonna rack us up, uh, bring us up to 200, you know? That, that's what I'm hoping for. So we'll see what happens. It, it wouldn't be the first time that something like this has happened where we've had some huge sale came, come in at the last second and save the day, bring us back up. But I want to mention that I've been testing out these specific landing pages for write app reviews. And uh, this testing, for whatever reason, has not been fruit as fruitful up until now. We'll see. I'm, I may be speaking too soon. So it, it may be that these, uh, either I'm, I'm really unlucky at this point in time, or these specific landing pages for write-up reviews are just not performing very well. I'm on email number seven at this point. So we'll see, maybe I'll switch over to social paid very shortly and 
the next email, I don't know, or maybe I'll take it up to the full 10 emails to get even more data to assess uh, how well these specific landing pages are performing for write-up reviews. I do know that they perform well for social paid. That's, that's a, a, a given for me, but we're still testing them out with write-up reviews. So anyways, let's dig a little bit deeper into this. This is for account number two, this sale over here. Okay, account number two. And um, you can see over here the progression over time. I can't go all the way back to day zero. But if I did go back to day zero, you'd see that there's no sales for a while. And then day 17 right over here, I get my first sale. And then sales have been consistent since. And then we've seen re recently, month four, back to back sales, back to back sales, back to back, back to back. And now things have been petering off a little bit, but we're gonna watch and see what happens in the following days. If we can, you know, jumpstart things again and get the ball rolling again in the right direction, get the momentum back on our side. And uh, there are many, there are different things that we can do to do that. One of them is to switch over to social paid. Actually, that's the main thing that we're gonna do to, to shift things around. The other thing would be to just keep sticking with write up reviews and see if things shift because we've had this huge spike. Maybe I was just unlucky and then things will start going in the opposite direction. But anyways, uh, we are at $308 for the month. We are at $2,912 gross running total. We're almost at 3,000 and we are at $1,652 net profit. Okay, so that is, oh yeah, one other thing to show you is this was for account two. So account two is at $533 now. And let's see over here, it is now had its 11th sale. And another thing to note is that I haven't updated this in the last few days, but we are well over 180,000 leads across our seven accounts, which is an insane number of leads. But there is something to be said about the maturity of your accounts. From past experience, the number of leads is not so as important as uh, the maturity of, a, of the accounts. Like if, if you've got one account with 50,000 leads, that's gonna be performing better than having seven accounts with 50,000 leads across all of them. I don't know why that is. It seems like as time goes on, the accounts tend to perform better for whatever reason. So having explained all of this, I think I've covered all my bases here. If you're newer here and you wanna come on board with this system and start making money in this way, it takes about 10 minutes a day to run this. If you wanna try this out, you come over here to this description over here, you click on this link, and if you click on this link, do let me know, send me an email at mikeiserconsulting at gmail.com, M-I-K-E-I-S-E-R consulting at gmail.com because I'll be able to send you over 500 free swipe files. And these swipe files, out of them, 200 of them are written in a generic fashion such that you can cut and paste them and promote whatever offer you want. So you could promote multiple income funnel, you could promote Warrior Plus offers, you could promote My Legion Secret itself. And the reason why, I'm tying back into what I said earlier, the reason why you're gonna wanna copy and paste these emails and promote My Legion Secret with them is so you can get that bottom sign up on your bottom account. So if you've got five accounts at 900 leads a day and you wanna have five accounts at 1,000 leads a day, which is an extra 3,000 leads a month, which is nothing to scoff at, right? That's significant. You can copy and paste these emails, get that bottom sign up by promoting My Legion Secret to the My Legion Secret leads and get that bottom sign up on your fifth account so that you're getting those bonus leads, okay? And also I'll provide you with some free email support because this game is really gonna mess with your mind. So if you, have, if you ever wanna <clears throat> contact me and run things by me, say, Mike, what's going on with my results over here? What would you suggest I do differently here? Because this game is a mind game. It's gonna mess with your mind, like it's messing with my mind right now, right? I'm not seeing the results that I'm looking for. So it's gonna mess with your mind and you're gonna need someone to keep you on track during all of this to make sure that you stick around and you make the right changes if you're doing things wrong because you can do things wrong in this very easily and mess up your results and get suboptimal results. And just one small mistake can mean the difference between you seeing the results you want and not seeing the results that you want, right? So I'll be able to provide you with that support, but do reach out to me at my email address if you've signed up to get those resources and to get that support as well. For everyone that signed up underneath me cur currently, do reach out to me, okay? I'm here to help you guys out. I wanna see as many people 
succeed as possible with this, okay? Now, having explained that, you're gonna click on this link. This will lead you to an overview of this system and how it all works. You could look through this, but you wanna click on this button here, this first button. Enter your email, click get started, and this will lead you over to the sales page, which looks like this. Now from here, you're gonna click this button and sign up for your first account. And when you've signed up for your first account, this is where you're gonna to have to start paying close attention because I wanna show you how to link your accounts properly to get those bonus leads. So when you're signing into your first account, first account, doesn't matter how you set this up. The second account, it does matter how you set it up. So you're gonna copy this referral link on your, on your account, paste it into the browser, and then sign up for your second account. That way, your second account is made underneath your first account, giving your first account 100 bonus leads. And you'll know that that's worked properly if you go to the My Leads here, and this shows as 200 instead of 100 will appear in this much time. Because typically, this is gonna say 100, right? So the first day, you're gonna have 100 leads for each account, but the second day, you're gonna see it update. You're gonna to have to wait for it to update. And then you'll have 300 leads total the second day and then 500, then 700, okay? So that's how it works. And uh, by the way, you're gonna have to use a different email address for each account that you create. With Gmail, you can create five Gmail accounts with one phone number. And if you run out of Gmails, you can use Yahoo, Mail.com, or ProtonMail. I tend to favor ProtonMail out of those. And another thing is, is that when you're creating these accounts in the same day, put a number at the end of your first and last name, like. Uh, Mike 2, Iser 2, Mike 3, Iser 3. Because if you create the same first and last name over and over again, the system might reject that and not let you create those accounts. So to avoid that, do that. And then later on, go to profile and delete the numbers at the end of your first and last name later on. And you're going to want to do that because if you don't do that, when people get emails from you, it'll say like Michael 2, Iser 2, and you don't want people to see your name like that if they happen to look at the sender. Right? You don't want that. And one last thing is that when you're creating these accounts, like I said before, account number two is made from account number one's referral ID, right? But when you create account number three, you use account number two's referral ID. You don't use account number one's. You use account number two's referral ID, okay? And then for account number four, again, you use account number three's referral ID over here and you chain them one under the other, okay? So that's how you set it up properly. If you run into any issues, contact support. They're aware people are creating these multiple accounts and they can sort you out. And one last thing is you can use the same credit card for each one of these accounts without any issue. And if a hold is put on it, it's because your credit card company, you know, they think that uh, something's up, you could call them and get that sorted out. But typically that's how the process works and you could set up your first five accounts no problem but having explained all of that you're going to go to clickbank.com set up a free account over here it's a simple sign up process i won't show you it but once you're signed up you're going to open this menu and go to accounts over here and create an account and you're going to create an account that's an affiliate account you're going to enter your nickname over here following these instructions click sign up and once you've done that this will pop up over here your nickname you're gonna click on the nickname, and then you're gonna see an overview of all your results. And from here, we're gonna open up the marketplace. And on the marketplace, you're gonna see different categories of products that you can promote on the side here. But we wanna promote e-business and e-marketing. That's what's gonna convert the best. Now, out of all these categories, all these products over here, we're gonna sort it by gravity. So we get the products at the top, which are generating the most sales for the most affiliates, and we wanna focus on promoting these ones here. So we are gonna promote either this one, number one, or number two. These are what perform the best. Now, we have not been seeing the best results with write up reviews, but we're gonna keep going with it. So what you're gonna do, is you're gonna open up this affiliate page here. Let me just, did it open? What happened here? Okay, there we go. And then, when this loads up, we're gonna get some email swipe files here to use for free. So we're gonna open this up, and out of these 10 emails, we're on email number, what did I say, six or seven? I don't know, let's say seven. We're gonna copy and paste this email, but you know what I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna show you, instead of doing it this way, I've provided you in the description, if you go to the description below, right over here, social paid and write-up reviews, bonus swipes, 
If you click on that link, it's going to bring up this page over here where you've got all these extra swipe files that you can copy and paste uh, and use, right? So what you can do is use these. And what you would do is you would copy this. So I've got different subject lines you can use here. And this is the email that I use today, by the way. So you could copy this, control C, come over here, go to your mailing system, select your leads, and then for the subject, press control B over here to paste the subject in here. Now this first name fix is basically a short code, which is gonna replace that with that person's actual first name. Now sometimes you may see a placeholder here in the emails, like name, like that. That's just telling you to replace that with this over here, okay? So do that, and let's look at the body over here. Let's copy the body all the way down to the signature, control C. Now, if you paste it in like this, in the body over here, so let me just click in here, press control A to highlight all the text, backspace, and control B. You can see that it's wonky. It's all bolded and it's all got weird spacing. So to avoid that, what I do is I paste it into a text file like this. And then I copy it over here and paste it in from the text file. And now the formatting is better, although there are some changes we're gonna have to make. We're gonna have to re-bold everything. So we're gonna have to go back over here and bold this, bold this. So let me just do all of this real quickly. Hit the link below, okay. Bold this, and this, and this. And the link is gonna go, recommend you click here. So I could either highlight this whole thing and make this a clickable link, or I could just make the clickable link just this small segment, but I'm gonna do the whole thing, okay? So that's gonna be our clickable link. Let me just fix that over there. And everything looks good up here, so now the next step is to put our link in over here. So normally what I would be telling you is to use the generic link, which is back over here, clicking promote, and then generate your hop link over here, right? But we're not gonna do that this time. We're going to use the one that's over here. So I've got a hop link right over here for you to copy and paste, but you're gonna have to alter this. And let me just copy this, control C, and paste this into the text file, just so I can show you what you need to change. You're gonna need to change where it says affiliate. ClickBank, your ClickBank ID. You're gonna put in your ClickBank nickname that we made earlier right in here. So mine is value null. And then over here at the end, where it says TID, that's trend tracking ID. We're gonna put in war for write app reviews, the product we're promoting, and MLGS1 for our first MLGS account. And then as you send out to your next account, you're gonna just change this to three, four, five, to track for all your different accounts, okay? But we're gonna start with one and copy this Come over here and with this highlighted, we're gonna click this button over here and control V, paste that in. Now we got our link in there. We're gonna hit perfect timing. And the reason we hit this is because MLGS keeps track of historical data as far as how the leads have been performing, what when they open up their emails rather. And it's gonna send it out at the best time when the lead is most likely to see it and open it. So that'll increase your open rate. So do hit that. And one thing is, is that there's gonna be two buttons over here. You're not seeing them because I've already sent out my mailing, but you'll see a preview button here and a send email button, an orange button like this. Now I've got a screenshot of it just to show you. You're gonna see this over here, right? So what you can do is you can hit preview and when you do that, this will pop up over here, a preview of your email and what it's gonna look like. You can hover over the links and see in the bottom corner, the link is appearing properly, you know, the in the corner of the browser. And you can actually click on the link itself and test the link out to see if it's working. And if you click on that link, you should see in your back office over here, if you go to tracking ID and you go for today, you make it, make sure it says today up here. I'm not gonna put today in because it's gonna spoil uh, tomorrow's video. I'll show you st uh, statistics from tomorrow's video. But anyway, let's assume this is today. And you're gonna just hit F5 to refresh. And you should see over here, this 274 updates to 275 because you clicked it um, where was I? Because you clicked it in, in this email, right? You click this thing in, in the email and this should update from 274 to 275. And if it does, you know that the link is working properly and you can check all the links. If you've got two links or three links, you can check all of them if, uh, if you wanna be doubly or triply certain with all of these, right? 
And once everything looks good to you, you just hit send email. And once you send the email, let me go back to this. You're gonna see some animated bars go across the bottom here. And then this will pop up over here, seeing that you gotta wait 23 hours before you can mail out again. So when that happens, you just repeat the same process for all your other accounts. And an easy way to do that is to right click here, duplicate tab, and on this duplicated tab, you're gonna sign out, sign back in with your second account, and copy and paste all the information over again. So now that we're logged into our second account, we go to the mailing system, select the leads over here, we come back a tab, and we copy this, control C over here, come over here, control V, come back, control, click in this box, control A, control C, come over here, click in this box, control A, backspace, control V, and then click on this link anywhere on it, and then click the button over here, link button, and change the one to a two, and now this is tracking for our second account. Double check everything looks good over here, click the perfect timing, double check up here, and hit send email, and it's that, that simple for each one of your accounts. And that's why I said earlier, this is a business model that takes you 10 minutes, and to be honest with you, it'll take you five minutes if you get it, if you do this enough times, Initially, you'll be taking a little bit longer because you're testing things, making sure you're doing it properly, but this is a five to 10 minute a day business, which is insane because in five to 10 minutes a day, you can go from making, like, like over here, my first month I made 250 with seven accounts, then I made 700, then I made 600, then 1,000, and right now I'm at $308 over the last 11 days. So we're gonna see what this goes up to by the end of the month but we are making profit each month with this easily like even this easily pays for that 210 dollars fee for my seven accounts i'm still in profit a hundred dollars so far this month so honestly i i can't complain i can't complain but you know there are people that are making much more than this there are people that are making three thousand a month four thousand a month so that is my goal, to be getting up to that same spot where I'm making that amount of money. So, and I, I'm sure that's the goal of many of you here that are on this journey as well. But this is where I'm at so far with my accounts. I'm sharing my journey with you here. So if you're new and you wanna come on board with this all, send me an email at mikeeiserconsulting at gmail.com. For everyone else, you know, give this video a like if you liked it. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in tomorrow's video.